So today's working hero handles making one of our most essential and hard to find items right now. Joining us from Albany, Georgia, it is John Pattinson. John, how are you? Doing good, how are you today? Good, buddy, nice to see you. So tell us exactly what your role is at Charmin. So my role here is I am the Charmin papermaking department leader. Uh, for and I'm responsible for the people uh, and one of the machines that produces Charmin uh, here at the site. So I mean, have you I have to... to think that you are the most important person on the planet right now. Toilet paper <laughs> is such a hot commodity. Are you making more than normal? Are you working 24 hours a day? What are you doing? Well, we always knew Charmin was a great product, but we never imagined that it was going to be this popular. Uh, we're absolutely working 24/7. Uh, to produce. Uh, we have been able to pull together and all of our folks have just done a fantastic job uh, to produce record levels of Charmin uh, over the past several months. So you speed up the whole process there at the factory? Is that how you do it? Well, we're just pulling together and figuring out how do we just push every everything we have uh, to continue to produce uh, more and more uh, throughout the, the whole network. So, John, how do you keep everyone safe there at work during this time? Well, it, it's really been amazing and humbling throughout the entire process. Uh, leadership from David Taylor, our CEO, down has been the first priority has been the health and safety uh, of our folks. So here at the site, what that looks like when I get out of the, my car uh, is I've put my mask on. Uh, so mm. the first thing I do is get my mask, uh, my safety glasses. I come up to the gate uh, where we used to have the turnstile. We now have hand sanitizer and more mask uh, for folks. So that way. Everybody can have a mask from gate to gate. Uh, we've opened the gate there uh, that ensures us we badge in, and then we come through the open gate uh, and follow their Charmin and Bounty uh, social distancing markers uh, staggered, staggered at six feet apart, um, which just helps us see social distancing at all times. Uh, and that leads me to the temperature taking session. Uh, at that point, what I do is I ask a series of questions um, that, hey, have I been exposed to COVID? Uh, do I have any symptoms? Have I had a fever since the last time I was in plant? Uh, and they take my temperature and then I go and follow uh, more of my signals. Uh, so we have dots uh, that are personalized for each department uh, that then lead me to uh, my work area. Uh, from that point is we'll start our, our morning meeting. Uh, we used to be uh, at the table together uh, and then really set our plans for the day. Uh, now, what that looks like is the room we've laid out uh, where everybody sits. So we've taped off the floor uh, to ensure that everybody has their location for social distancing. Uh, and we go through our plans for the day. Uh, and really through this, we, we've lost that Southern hospitality uh, as we have shifted the start times at the gate uh, where we would used to, to greet folks and see people as you're coming in is that it's very lonely and uh, distant. Uh, that you'll see folks. So it's much quieter around the plant uh, and much more difficult as you are making your plans and working uh, is to uh, how do we do it differently? Yeah, I can I can imagine that your already challenging job has been made that much more challenging because of these safety measures, but you are a father of five. And so safety wow. first, I'm sure, is t paramount to you. Uh, absolutely. And, uh, I know your eldest just graduated high school, so congratulations on that. It's a huge milestone. Yeah, thank you. So we were uh, very excited this weekend, uh, Deerfield. Uh, we we're very grateful for the faculty and staff there that were able to put together a live graduation, uh, and we were able to, to see that in person. So it was a very proud moment for all of us. Well, John, we thank you for your essential job. We appreciate that. Thanks for coming on, and take good well, care of yourself. You okay, pal? I will do. Thank you all very much. Okay, buddy. Bye-bye. Thank you all. Wow. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I mean, I love Charmin, but now knowing the man behind the man behind the product makes you love it exactly. so much more. A, a, right? a, a face to the product. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we'll, ta we'll take a quick break and come back with Debbie Mazar right after this. Stay with us. Go!